Governor's Minister Gail Teixeira is not taking kindly to allegations of corruption and discrimination level against her government. And she posited that the government of Guyana has been managing the affairs of government transparently and inclusively since its assumption to office on August 2, 2020. At a recent town hall meeting held in New York on Sunday, allegations of suppression of information, government censorship of critics, and discrimination were among the issues that were raised. In a statement released on Monday night, Minister Teixeira said the government is not afraid of the facts. As she said, they are managing the country effectively and are doing so transparently. According to the minister, the ethnic composition of the three branches of government demonstrate a level of ethnic diversity not seen in the U.S. or other developed countries, even though we are a country of minorities. The minister went after Rickford Burke and noted that the Guyanese Diaspora Town Hall meeting on October 30th was another Rickford Burke one-man organization orchestrated event to rehabilitate his discredited image after he attempted to extort $200 million from a Guyanese businessman. The minister noted the attendees were the hardcore APNU supporters and a few local elected leaders. She did not let retired Assistant Police Commissioner Paul Slow off the hook as she claimed that he had refused to appoint senior officers recommended by the Acting Commissioner of Police. However, the officers who were not promoted moved to the court challenging the list. The case was eventually thrown out by the Chief Justice. Slow was suspended as Chairman of the Police Service Commission by President Efenali some months after taking office.